This is Ms. Nunez, and we are going to solve a problem using an solve an equivalent problem strategy. Relate the numbers of units to the size of the units used to measure an object. How many gallons of water could a leaky faucet waste in one year? Enough to fill a drinking glass? A kitchen sink? How about a tub? What you'll need to know is our faucet drips one drop every two seconds. You'll need to set up your problem to look like one drop divided by two seconds times 60 seconds divided by one minute times 60 minutes divided by one hour times 24 hours divided by one day times seven days divided by one week times one teaspoon divided by 20 drops times one pint divided by 96 teaspoons times one gallon divided by eight pints. Next, you'll need to cancel out like measurements. Here I've demonstrated canceling out drops and minutes. You should be left with gallons over weeks. Again, the mathematical version is open parentheses 1 times 60 times 60 times 24 times 7 times 1 times 1 times 1 close parentheses divided by 2 times 1 times 1 times 1 times 1 times 20 times 96 times 8 close parentheses. Then you'll need to divide the numerator by the denominator. 6,004,800 divided by 30,720. Your answer is 19.68 gallons a week. You could fill a kitchen sink, but not a bathtub or a pool. Again, establish your problem as print open parentheses 1 times 60 times 60 times 24 times 7 times 1 times 1 times 1 close parentheses divided by open parentheses 2 times 1 times 1 times 1 times 1 times 20 times 96 times 8 close parentheses now let's apply the same method to figure out the original question of how much water could a leaky sink waste in one year The mathematical version is one gallon times divided by one week times 52 weeks divided by one year. Cancel out like measurements for 1,040 gallons a year.